Hey, what's up, man? FightHype.com here with Jared Hurd. Jared Hurd, what's going on, bro? How's it going? How you doing? Good, good, man. So, uh, Castano just got the stoppage. They mentioned your name. What are your thoughts on that fight? <laughs> Possibility in the future? Listen, that was a great fight, man. Castano hit all my keys to victory, and uh, he went there, got the stoppage. And me being a former champion, and him not being a champion no longer, he um, it, it's always a great matchup with his style, his his pressure, his velocity of punches he put out. It's kind of similar to my style, and I know that both of us are in the same ring together. That's great for TV, so we can definitely make that. Happen. What's up, man? So, I mean, you mentioned you mentioned him being a former champion, uh -huh. right? And, and, um, obviously, the J. Rock fight fell through for whatever reason. I know you don't really want to go into too much of that, right? But I mean, is that a fight that is eventually going to happen in the future or something? Well, maybe. Well, the, 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 the match with me and uh, Castillo between, oh. between you and J. Rock. Oh yeah, me and J. Rock. We will have to see, man. You know. Uh, I, the fight didn't fall through. It had a lot to do with my, my situation I was in. And uh, we'll see, man. You know, uh, I'm not sure exactly when, but I, I definitely do want to win my title back. I, I mean, I heard that you trained, you changed trainers in the process. Was right. I would imagine that J-Rock, the loss of J-Rock had something to do with that, correct? Uh, well, not, uh, not necessarily. It's more of respect that I did lost it had a lot to do with it but you know like I said I'm gonna be fighting soon I don't want to put too much out there I want all the viewers that I know want to hear about Swift Jared Hurt I know they want to know the story behind everything and just tune in man I should be fighting sometime maybe in December hopefully or January and uh, I'm, I'm gonna put the story out to the world what really happened. So, so not only did you change, change trainers you also changed haircuts I've seen a lot of people well, right. want to make the correlation between the change of trainers and the change of the haircut. Is there any? Is there any truth to that? Oh uh, man, like I said, tune in, guys. I, 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 it's on the tip of my tongue. I want to put out there, but like I said, um, one thing I can say that I had put out there, I did change trainers. Uh, I'm training with uh, Coach K. Karoma now, uh, who's also trained us, uh, Shakur Stevenson, and uh, you know, um, like I said, our chemistry, and, and, and we got to work things out to see, uh, you know. Um, what it's, what it's going to be like being in a chair in the ring together. So, so far, I love the train. I love working with them. We're just going straight. Man. I, got, and, I got it from here, man. I got it. And uh, at the end of the day, tune in. And uh, so Canelo Kovalev hasn't yet happened yet. It's probably going to happen in the next few minutes. Right. Canelo's also a possibility. He's anywhere from 160 all the way up to 175. Is that a fight you want in the future? Oh, definitely. You know, Canelo, um, he is making a big jumps, um, um, you know, in these weight classes because he wants to um, he building, working on building his legacy. And, and, and me and Canelo both are former 154 pounders. And, uh, you know, eventually I, 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 I'm thinking soon a fight. He's not going to stay at those weight classes. He's always going to come back down to 160. So if, he, if you want to make a clash up in that weight class, I'll definitely be willing to make that. You just said four more 154 pounders. So we see John Turner back in 154. Guys, gotta tune in, man. I know you wanna know, but hey, listen, I'm fighting pretty soon, so it should be out there pretty soon. But uh, you know, I'm, I'm letting the world know everything's going on. All right, man. Hey, I appreciate the interview. Most definitely.